guys, I have been getting calls today that say voicemail. As you can see, my private number is covered up, of course. But I'm like, how am I calling myself? It'll come in and it'll ring and it'll say voicemail, of course, because it's my number. So I decided to answer it and it says, hello, this is Microsoft. Okay, I've heard of this Microsoft scam, especially the job I work at because, you know, I deal with fraud. But I'm like, I've never heard of it calling. Usually they try to call a number that's similar to yours or that's in the area that it's tricky. But how you going to call for my own number? So I decided to answer it. The first time I was like, you know what? I don't feel like dealing with this. So I hung up on them. The second time I answered and they was about to start the scam. But I don't know if I accidentally hung up on them or they can tell on my voice that I know they was full of <laughs> crap. So they hung up on me. But if they call again, I'm definitely going to try to catch it. I'm going to try to play with them and make them think that I'm fooling, falling for their crap. Um, but basically what they're doing is telling you that your computer is hacked. They're going to tell you that they are Microsoft and that you need to pay for an antivirus. And they're going to get your credit card information and charge you, you know, I've seen it anywhere from around 300 or more. And then they're going to tell you the remote access in your computer. So that means that they're going to be moving your mouse and computer around. So, you know, some people will get fooled by that and think that they're a real computer tech person when they're scammers. So if you get a call that says they are Microsoft and your computer has been compromised, please, please do not be fooled by this crap, Ola. Do not be fooled. If you really think your computer has been compromised, please get with either a family member you know that is tech savvy that can fix your computer for you or get with a local computer repair company that is very reputable, that has a very good reputation because there are so many scams in this world. You really can't trust anything. And another thing I want to note, if a company reaches out to you and say they are such so Microsoft, Wells Fargo, or whoever, and you don't recognize that number, hang up on them and call. If it's a company you deal with, call either the number on your statement or call the number on the back of your credit card or debit card or whoever you whatever you have with them to make sure you're actually speaking to the real company. Because there are a lot of scammers who pretend to be other companies. Example, you just seen Microsoft tried to call me. Well, they say they're Microsoft, but I'm sure they're in a foreign company um, country. I'll let you hear this clip of the recorded the piece of the recorded call I got next. Hi, this is Frank. I'm calling from the Windows Technical Department. So how are you? I'm good. How are you? The reason of this call is that, like, ma'am, we are receiving lots of error and a warning from your computer, which indicate that your IP address it has been compromised. Oh my goodness! What do I do? 